the Atlanta Braves and Jake Peavy. Listen, there's a big difference between wanting something and needing something. The Atlanta Braves need Jake Peavy. Actually, they need Jake Peavy and his twin brother, Bob Peavy, as long as he can pitch. The Atlanta Braves are not in the greatest of bargaining positions. What do you have to do if you're Frank Wren? You've got to draw a line in the sand. But then you better be willing to move the line a little bit. How many prospects do you want to need to give up? Jair Zerzins can't have him. He's my cheaper alternative, and why get a guy if I don't have the other guy? And you better have at least two. With Tim Hudson down from what might be the whole year next year, the Atlanta Braves are in a spot where they need two starting pitchers. I need Jurgens, but I need Peavy. What do I give up? I give up one of my middle infielders. I give up one of the outfield prospects, but I can't give up my top pitching prospect. Listen, more often than not, those guys don't pan out anywhere close to what a Jake Peavy's career can be as long as he's healthy. Oh, by the way, did I mention, make sure you got a really good doctor looking at Jake P because if you make a deal like this, let the buyer beware, and there are no returns. You buy as is. He's had a couple of injuries. He's had a couple of things. You better hope that you can ensure that those things don't lead to your problems down the road. Contract makes a lot of sense to the Braves, and the Braves have money. But again, getting Jake Peavy, I give up one of the middle infielders, Janelle Escobar or Kelly Johnson. Got to do it because I got to give something to get something. I've got to give up one of the outfield prospects, but then I've got to find another pitching prospect. I'm sorry Charlie Morton and a couple of these guys didn't pitch better, JoJo Reyes, you included, where this deal could have been more viable. They don't have value now, and the Padres need and want value. They want cheap value, too, by the way. Here's the other little catch. They don't want Khalil Green, $6.5 million. Maybe that's why they want Yunel Escobar, because Khalil Green's going to come over. If you've got to do it on those grounds, then you better also say, if I take 6 and a half this year to give to him, what can I not get? And the Braves need more than Khalil Green. It's going to be tricky for Frank Wren. We said it tonight that Mark Teixeira was traded. Frank Wren, you wanted the job. You waited in line. Hell, you probably earned it. But you are now the Atlanta Braves general manager. You are on the clock. You need a pitcher, then you need another one. If Jake Peavy is the one that you can get through the trade, you better do it. If you got to have money for free agency, you better find it. You better ask for it. You better spend it wisely. The Atlanta Braves are at least four steps away from being a true contender in the National League. This is step one. Get it done sooner than later, but make sure at the end you can deal with the fact that you gave up what you gave up for down the road.